Good morning. It's a beautiful summer, early June, Friday morning. Started out in the 50s, it's going to go up to 80 degrees today. The flowers are still bright and beautiful. And I can praise God for what he's brought. In fact, as I rode my bike this morning, it almost brought tears to my eyes at the beauty of the flowers on the way along the river, the smell of the lilacs and the flocks, the smell of the peonies that are now popping up, the beautiful bunches, the plenty of pink and purples and reds and whites. They're just beautiful, and the perfume that comes from them is extraordinary, even overwhelming. Overwhelming, overflowing, sometimes like tears. Today I write about dry eyes, dry eyes that we can have in a desert, dry eyes that itch, are red, they might hurt. I have dry eyes from surgeries that I've had on my eyes, some five different surgeries that have dried up my tear ducts. I need a lubricating kind of drops that I put on frequently during the day. I need to carry it with me and if I forget, my eyes begin to dry, be itchy, and feel like sand is in them. They begin to be like the Mojave Desert. And they even get a little bit blurry. I can't see as well. I can't see clearly now. I need to see clearly. We need to see clearly. This world is a difficult place and if we can't see clearly, it makes it even harder. So we need to do what we can to see clearly, to read, to study, especially to be thankful to God that we can see, if we can, and to ask him to help us to see. I don't know what to do, but my eyes are on you, scripture says. Help us to see more clearly. Help us to know what you would have us to do. I'm seeing the ophthalmologist on Monday. It's an annual checkup. I've had retina surgeries, cataract surgeries, lasers, work, all kinds of things to try to correct vision. And in certain ways it's better, in certain ways it's worse. But as I lubricate my eyes, it is refreshing. It is restoring a certain vision, a lubrication to my eyes, like God lubricates our eyes with his word. When we seek his word, when we look at his word, we are given wisdom. We are given strengthening. We are given what his word brings. It's inerrant, it's healing, it's comforting, it's strengthening, strengthening, it's convincing, it's convicting, it's counseling. It is the word of God. It is what we need to guide us, guard us, lubricate us on our walk. May you be able to see clearly today the beautiful flowers. Lubricate your eyes. Keep looking for the beauty that is surrounding us. Amen.